So shortly after Father's Day in 2011, I learned that my dad was diagnosed with stage four lung and bone cancer, and we lost him a couple months later. Then in 2014, shortly after Mother's Day, I learned my mother had stage four lung and brain cancer, and we lost her in 2015. So uh, the Be Strong event near and dear to my heart, and very glad to see it's uh, being supported by the Sheriff's Office. Me Strong's mission is to support the friends, family, and individuals battling cancer through the power of friendship. Since our first race in 2012, we've helped 338 families and are well on our way to giving half a million dollars to other people battling cancer, and we also fund a research grant, and we're thrilled to have the Sheriff's Office involved in this year's event. Chances are, someone we know or someone close to us is going to be affected by cancer. We here at the Volusia County Sheriff's Office want to do all we can to support those who have battled or are battling cancer. On January 28th at 8 o'clock, Me Strong is going to run a 5K race. We are asking everyone who sees this message to come out and support this wonderful organization in this 5K race through downtown Deland. When I was diagnosed with cancer for the third time, I had just run my first marathon and my friends wanted to find a way to do something that would make me feel supported and loved and so they asked if they could host a 5k in DeLand in my honor. So we gave that very first race a try just to sort of inspire her but we ended up inspiring a whole community. It just worked and then almost 900 people showed up and it was amazing. And then we had money left over. And so that's when we were like, well, gosh, we can give this money away to people who are battling cancer. And that's when we decided to take Me Strong to a larger stage and become a 501c3 charity. And our mission was to support the friends and families and individuals battling cancer through the power of friendship. That's what it's really about, is just having the support and, and someone behind you letting you know that it's okay and that you can make it. There are people that are going to be out here today that have never done, they, they can't even imagine they would have ever walked or run three miles. And I think that kind of journey symbolizes what a lot of people through cancer go through. You know, they, they are not prepared necessarily to face what they're facing. And when they get through it, and with the help of a lot of people, kind of like getting through a race, it, it's a milestone. It gives me hope. Um, I still do treatments every single month. I'm, I have a battle. I, I don't know how much longer I have, but every breath I have, I will definitely be helping me strong. They, they're, they're my lifeline. Last year, I was in um, cast, because one of the chemos they were giving me um, caused my feet to like strain up really bad. And um, me and my sister rode a tandem bike. So we got to do the first race together. It brings everybody together. A lot of the businesses support me strong. Uh, we as a business support me strong. We think it's great. Good cause. We're from Stetson University and we're um, we're fighting for the cause. That's why we came out here to the Me Strong race. My husband was diagnosed with lung cancer a year and a half ago. And um, I've run this, this is actually my fourth year running, um, but we didn't think he'd be here today. So he's here cheering us on on the route. And we are walking today because our friend Diana, Diana passed away with cancer in October. So it's real, it has a real true meaning for us. I'm on uh, Team Charlie Lundell and um, it's in honor of Charlie Lundell, who was a teacher at Pine Ridge High School. I'm Melanoma, so my wife supported me, <laughs> so it's very important. Team Denoff. Team Denoff. We're Team Denoff for uh, Dr. Frank Denoff. We're, We're part, part of Team Savvy. I think it brings people together from different walks of life. Like I saw all kinds of people out there, elderly, young, different races. It's great to have that kind of diversity brought together. Every time I show up, I'm so proud to be from DeLand. I've never seen an event where more people from the community come and support and cheer. I feel like we're entering the fight. We're fighting with people who can't fight for themselves. A lot of credit goes to the five ladies that uh, have organized me strong and, and not only the race, but the other events that they do in and around our community. And it's just a, a wonderful community event that brings people together. And that's what makes the land uh, a wonderful place to live, work, and fly. I think the future of me strong has no limits, there are no boundaries, there's no stopping us. We look at it as five friends having fun and to feel that the whole community is behind us is 
amazing. And I hope that it continues to grow and it continues to get people out, supporting their friends, as well as supporting themselves, not just if you're battling cancer, but just making a commitment to living healthy. I hope that somebody will pick up and, and uh, carry it through to um, hopefully a cure for cancer something that we won't have to worry about anymore. It's incredible to be able to leave an impact on, um, on the world and, and I feel like that's really what we're doing.